guys I'm on my way to the bank now which is downtown it's gonna take the bus like last night but uh, this is where my couch surfer lives this uh, area but he lives like there's like three universities around here so that's always good I always feel safe when there's like universities not just safe but it's just, I think I like that just to see a little bunch of young people around <laughs> I actually thought those things were real. <laughs> I was walking by, I was like, wait a second, what kind of animal is that? <laughs> Got me. Jesus, guys, look at these prices. 295 for that shirt and 319 for that shirt. They weren't joking when they say everything's here is expensive. I don't even know that brand. But um, 319, that's like 140 US dollars for that shirt. And from a brand, I mean, maybe it's a good brand, but I've never heard of it. But yeah, everything here is really, really, really expensive. Because they have like a high import tax. So everything that comes in, they just like tax. I think it might be like 20%, and I'm not really sure, but it's really high. And then once it gets here, then the people that sell it, like, overpriced stuff, like, so much. <laughs> Instead of making like, you know, maybe... $10 on a shirt, they hike it up to like making $60 per shirt. I mean, people here just want to profit so much out of everything. So yeah, and combine that, like the high tax and people just being greedy, then everything here is expensive. I went to the bank and I got some money out, so then I just walked around before going back to Lissandro's house. And, um, how we go? I just came to this uh, market open well it's like a market that has you know like all the markets as always like they have a lot of stuff that they sell inside and of course they always have the, the food court which is right here so I just came here and just got some food let's see how good it is so guys as always if you want to eat some typical food from that country and more importantly from that state because you know every state has a different cuisine uh, always go to the markets, go to a market and then go to the food court and you will get some really good, fresh, cheap food. So like I was telling you guys yesterday, the uniforms here are really, really cool. I don't know if you guys can see them, but uh, they're just like t-shirts, like some of them are just like soccer jerseys. I think they're pretty cool. I've noticed there's so many students here. Everywhere I go is a bunch of students. It's Lissandro's dog right here. He's like a pit bull mix. He's a, he's a really cool, nice dog, but he's strong as shit. Like, he'll jump on you and he can drop you if he wanted to. Smile! But it's like an old, yeah, a little old. So guys, we came to the boardwalk here. We're gonna drink a few beers. I'm here with my host, Sandra. We're just gonna have a few, a few beers here before I leave tomorrow. But it's raining, as you guys can see. So we'll see what we can do here. So the crew has assembled. The guys that picked me up the other day, all friends of Sandra. We're just having a 3.5 liter. Good music, good view, good beer, good friends. So we're still here drinking, having fun with these guys. We're all still here. We got two more people in the Adrian and what's your name? Come on. So that's our second whatever this is called, so we're going at it. So guys, as you guys can see, we finished everything here. It's about time to close the place down, but we're gonna go somewhere else, hopefully. Look at this Casanova over here. So that's where we were, Mercado Velo. Now we're going... Mr. Rosales. This guy right here, his name is Adrian. Yeah, my friend. 
fun. He's a real, he's a very fun guy. <laughs> it's a good person, man. It's a good person. I hope to see him in Colorado so we can show him around. One, one day maybe I will go to I'm buy, Colorado. I'm buying him some marijuana. <laughs> yeah, it's there. I'm here. <laughs>